Hello my friends, this video is to show you how to reset an unresponsive desktop. Now this isn't something that happens all that often, it happened to me just a few days ago. But every once in a while in Windows uh, 10, you'll find that your desktop has become completely unresponsive. You can't right click, you can't drag and select, you can't right click on, an, on a folder, you can't double click on one and have it open up, you can't do any of that. It just doesn't respond. And so in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix that. Now, along the taskbar here at the bottom, this is actually a separate process that's running, so you should still be able to use this. If for whatever reason you can't, you may have to reboot the whole system, unfortunately. But you should still be able to use these, these along the bottom. If you can, then you should have this guy right here, this folder, that will open up your, um, your uh, Explorer. If not, if you don't have this icon there, then you can also type explorer.exe in the bar there, and it'll open up the same window. Now, once this window is open, it's a very simple process. Control, you hold down Control, Shift, and Escape, all three keys, and that brings up the task manager that we all know and love. Now, if you click on any of these, calendar here, I've got Camtasia that I'm recording with, and the actual recording function here in Opera, down here on this button, you'll see it says End Task. But here's Windows Explorer that we just opened up, and you'll notice instead of End Task, it actually says Restart. And if you click on that, you notice that your screen will either go black or your icons will refresh. There we go. And once that happens, you should have full use of all of those icons back and your desktop should be restored. So there you go, a very easy fix for when your desktop locks up. Hopefully that helped and I will see you next time.